one of the same crew. But that game is unimportant right now. What is important is this Tekken 7 action. Suka versus Devilgen. Here we go. I believe historically uh, Ludovic has gotten the upper hand over Hayato. Hayato, however, has really been trying to take down those top players of the region. He's close, too. Round one. Fight. There we go. All right. Some movement coming in from both these players. Both very cautious and getting the electric fist to start the round with. You look at that damage instantly into the wall carry, but he can't get the back two follow up. However, he does find the pickup yet again, but the side wall there preventing him from the balcony break. Ludovic, a fan of those safe buttons, looking for that you know, little poke just to open him up. profile of a super to get in there really going to keep him safe on those electric office moving forward gets the flip kick back into the wall carry but can't get any more damage off that finisher he will, however will find a low and clear out that first game fight electric godfist to start off the round yet again this time it was much more immediate it's the full combo there and that time look at that damage good 55 percent at the start of the round if he is, is able to find himself a parry, however, and starting to inch his way back into an even game. Excellent sidestep action coming in from Ludovic. As Steve mentioned uh, last match when he was playing against Gunslinger, I would say movement is definitely one of Hayato's weaknesses here. Both reading movement and doing it himself. However, he is able to find himself around as we move into the third one. Wall carry into the reset, into the faked out low. I like what I'm seeing from Ludovic. You got paid out? You got second? Wait. You got second? Hell yeah! Let's go cross tag. My man Scythe getting second out here on cross tag. Let's go. My man Ludovic in his second round in game one. Let's go. He finds that uh, up forward one into the kick. Oh, I thought he was going to go for the unblockable there, but he did, however, just go for the high, which worked as well. Charging up, but doesn't get the grab. Iodo staying on the ground wisely there, but wasn't wise when he did stand up, though. Ludovic taking the first game. Game number two, looking like we're staying with the Devil Gen this time around. <clears throat> Good ascent. He's ready to fight. Round one. Devil Gen is at least. Let's hope Hayato is as well. Very commanding start so far from Hayato. He's starting with Electric Godfist or up forward fours and just catching him with it near every time. The problem is he's he's sort of reverse snowballing, starting out strong, but then as the match goes on, it slowly deteriorates as Ludovic finds ways to pick apart his defenses and find his way in. Oh, I, thought, I almost thought that was a grab break for a second. I've never seen that grab before in my life. Into the wall carries for full damage, into the floor pickup, or Oh. Ludovic is not messing Fight. around right now, ladies and gentlemen. This little Asian girl is here to fight. Blocks the Hell Sweep, but doesn't really get a full punish off of it. Does, however, get a punch barrier there. Still looking very strong moving forward, chipping away at that health bar. I think Ludovic is looking out for the unblockable there, so he's pressing a button only to get hit by the high kick instead. Ludovic 
pick up two rounds right now. Looking very solid right now. He seems to have his opponent picked apart. Seeing the Street Fighter Fundamentals coming in, that forward and back movement to bait out those uh, attacks and just whiff punish. You saw it right there. Now his back is against the wall, and he will get full damage for it. Ludovic up 2-0 now. Stay with Devil Jin this time around. Last time he was in this situation, you saw the Jin. And it didn't quite work out as well as he wanted. Perhaps why he's sticking with the more fundamental based Devil Jin he has. And finds himself a follow up there. Ooh, counter hit. That will be a full damage combo if he gets it to the wall. He does. Doesn't quite get a follow up there. Ooh, an excellent sidestep though to catch those punches. He was just throwing out in the air there. Ludovic up around yet again. Has now won, I believe, six rounds in a row. Five or six, something like that point is he's doing very well and look who came crawling back to me perfect what's up stream sorry guys there's a little complication going on fight back well, welcome back thanks man we so, missed you out here man thanks man so you got Lud. <laughs> it's so funny to see Lud play Tekken I mean I know he's a, he is a Tekken player but his dominance in Street Fighter is quite good I don't, nowadays, he's been dominating in both games. He's singing winner's finals right now of Street Fighter. Yeah, but Tekken, what's he been doing in Tekken? He's been taking Xanadu's are coming close, too. He's about to get his run back at Gunslinger right now. Oh, really? Unless Hado makes some, like, three miracles in a row happen. Mm. Let not blocking the Hell Suite. He probably thought it was Shung Lee. Two Fairy. Oh, that was okay, good. Okay, the, the moment you come back on, Hayato starts winning. What kind of black magic did you cast on him? Nah, man. Hayato realizes that, like, he needs to envision, like, uh, Asuka being Chung Li and just win. And just realize it's in the wrong game. Exactly. You well, might be onto something here. Hey, man, Tekken vs. Street Fighter, don't, don't count it out. Don't forget. You might, ooh, nice whiff punish. 1-1-2. One, one, two, one, one, two. Oh. I was noticing Kiara was having the same problem he had last time, where he's just not moving. See, this is the thing about Asuka. Asuka's one of those characters that you, like, when she whips something, you're always like, I'm going to whip one of shit. Then they cancel into the counter. You have to have make sure your chicken's are on point. And I ain't talking about Popeye's a KFC, guys. Chicken is a reversal on a counter. Ooh! Ooh excellent stuff there. Hayato forcing the game five, finally. Hayato says, I'm here to play Tekken, not Street Fighter. Watch your feet! He's blocked every hell sweep when you weren't on the mic. What what happened? Hey man. Tooth fairy. Oh no. Whip punish. Oh, oh wow. Oh. Oh, but misses lasers. He went for a high finish there. I don't blame him. Oh. Lud crouching like a 2D game. Blocking a hell sweep. That was a reset. Ooh. Oh big punish. Hayato on the board, finally. Okay, I mean, he is playing the top tier character, Devil Jin. No, it's hard to say where Asuka is on the tier list, though, because she's very underrepresented, but I feel a very strong character. She's very good in the hands of somebody who knows how to play very, uh, uh, guessy. You know what I mean? Like, are you, are you willing to take the risk? Calculated risk is what I call it. Because Asuka, you know, she, she doesn't, she's not a combo heavy character. She's a very conditioned uh, type of character, you know what I mean? Right. And like I said, Lud is, as you can see, Lud's movement is not playing Tekken. He's not Korean backdash and he's not really stepping. He's playing more like a Street Fighter game. He's right? doing more backdash, forward dash, like you would see in Street Fighter. Exactly. Just to bait out moves to whip punch. Exactly. And that's, that's the thing about, you know, playing Asuka. You know, she just has different styles. Now, I see a Japanese Asuka, and they're moving. Wow. Oh, and gets the ultimate tackle, but it gets reversed. 
Heisen says, you know what? I play Tekken, bro. Blood with a wake up down too. Random oh. super, but Lut blocks it. Yeah, he does. All right. I, mean, I knew Lut was going to block that. I mean, he does. He, he deals with wake up super all the time in Street Fighter, so I don't see how it would be any different in Tekken. Like Lut stepped at uh, that uh, uh, Wind God Fist, not the electric. Ooh. And she made him, but. Mm. Oh, wow, that excellent movement to get that health sweep as well. I, th I think he's actually showing Lut way too much respect. He needs to go in and stop being afraid. He has a Mishima. I don't think that Asuka does well against Mishimas unless she can guess, like, every single block. The Kark Will of Doom. Is that really too far different from her normal playstyle, though? You yeah. said she was a guessy based character for the most part. I mean, she is. I mean, like, think about it. I mean, like... Lut was this, this ghetto Korean backdash. <laughs> but uh, no, I'm saying she's definitely a guessy kind of character. I mean, if you notice, he's, Lut's not doing the optimal combos. He's just poking and he's just, you know, using his guessing w within the strings. You know what I mean? Maybe he might block low and block high. Or he'll do a counter or two. But I don't think Heisei's familiar with the matchup. But this is Tekken. He could always come back. If yeah, I mean, we saw it last time. He was down two games and reverse 3 0 him to... You know, continue this set. See what I mean? Calculated guess. Right. Oh, then the, the delayed low as well to clear out the set. Ludovic winning that run back against, or earning the run back against Gunslinger.